Today on the Stay at Home Chef, I'm gonna show you how to make my cream cheese and avocado wontons with cilantro lime dipping sauce. First, we're just gonna to put together our dipping sauce. That way it's already done and ready to go for when our wontons are ready. Pour in your soy sauce. Then we'll pour in our two tablespoons of rice vinegar. The juice from two limes. And then we'll go ahead and eyeball about two tablespoons of honey. Now the garlic, minced ginger, my secret weapon for mincing ginger, a garlic press. We'll whisk this all together and add in our cilantro. And that's it for our sauce. We can just set it aside and start working on our wontons. Now we'll just get the oil heating. We wanna heat it to about 350 degrees. While the oil is heating up, we'll go ahead and start making our wontons. Put some cream cheese into a bowl and we're gonna whip it until it's light and fluffy. Next, we're just gonna dice the avocado really small and fold it into our cream cheese. Put a tablespoon of water in a bowl and crack an egg right into it. And whisk that together. Now just set up a little assembly line with your egg wash, wonton wrappers, and your filling. You'll also need a plate to work on and a plate to keep the finished ones on. Take a wonton wrapper, brush it with a little of the egg wash, both sides. Scoop a little bit of the filling. and then fold. Fold it into a triangle. Make sure you kind of seal all the edges here. And then fold over all the corners. Make sure there's no air bubbles in there. And there you go. Once you have a batch, you'll just drop them in carefully into the hot oil and fry them. You'll want to work in batches and keep checking the temperature of the oil because it does cool. Once they start to brown, flip them over. You want them to be nice and golden. Once they're done, you'll transfer them to a paper towel lined plate. Serve it up with the cilantro lime dipping sauce and you have a tasty treat. Cream cheese and avocado wontons. If you like this recipe, give it a quick thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. For the full written recipe, visit my website, www.thestayathomechef.com.